Hello world and welcome back to more Hogwarts Legacy with your boy X33 or Zepta. Uh, last we left off, we watched Sebastian kill his uncle. Now we we kind of figured something like that was going to happen when, you know, something had to have happened where he used Avada Kedavra. Uh, but anyway, we were picking up with the very next quest of San Bacar's Trial. And if you have been following along and you do like and enjoy the, these videos, please do leave a like and a subscribe and maybe even a comment and a referral to a friend as it really does help this channel grow. Thank you very much and now uh, let's get it. Uh, we're essentially just doing this mission until someone sends us an owl. My owl. I need to tell him and the keepers that Ranrock knows where the last repository is. All five of you need to, to shut up. I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. This is grave news indeed. We had hoped for more time to discuss the best path forward. Thank you, Tig, for letting everybody Let know. Let us hear what the student has to say. I have a name. Professor, you received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bragpool's journals. He killed Lodgok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Lodgok. Lodgok and Ranrock were brothers. Lodgok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Surely this changes things. <clears throat> Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Isadora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. I've seen her memories. Isadora left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? Mm -hmm. Her memories showed what she did for her father, which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And a conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. Yep. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. Hmm. Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. Okay. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils, whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. Indeed, indeed we can. Um, is that really down there? Marwin? Marwin? Samba cars, trial, ah, Crag. Cragcroft. Something like that. I feel like we're really moving into the uh, You're here. later stages of Endgame here. Do you here. recognize the head sculpted there? Um, no, I haven't seen it actually. That's a head. I can't say that I do. It appears to be a fearsome beast known as a graphorn. Ah. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a graphorn will somehow open the way forward. That's what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. That's it easy. would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of graphorns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. 
I'm ready. If that's what must be done, I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. That's now, what that Professor skeleton Rackham is. Professor made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. So you just brought me here to show me the... Ah, uh, right. I have been here before. I mean, obvious by the fact that the uh, fast travel point here has been activated. But, beside the point, uh, let's fast travel down here. So glad this mission is finally open. Off on another adventure, oh, we? shut up, Ignatia. <sighs> so annoying. There's only one spawn spot from the whole map. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. I don't want it. This must be the place. Oh, it is. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Hi, yeah. Now you've blocked me from flying. Oh, wow. I'm not gonna kill it, but I am not. Oh, got him. Second phase, I should have known. Oh yeah. Get him. There it is. Let's go. Felt like if I had just kept attacking, he would have just kept attacking. I need your help, friend. <laughs> Mad. That is so cool. Grapon has a powerful charge attack that deals large amounts of damage to enemies in certain barricades. Hold L2 to initiate. Keep an eye on the Grapon stamina meter as charging will drain it. What say we pick up the pace a bit? This is kind of cool. Have seen better days. Whoa. See how the Lord of the Shore feels about his neighborhood being invaded. No! <laughs> 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 That's kinda cool. No, you won't. Is 
this thing even have full damage? Can it swim? Yes, it can. I've probably just chosen the longest way to do this. Can I get off? Yes, I can. And yes, we are going to ride it though, because as if you wouldn't. Let's go, Grappy. I need to race now, my friend. Just resetting the animation because speed lines weren't showing up. Slow down now. There we go. Probably just the magical beast's essence, something or all. That's cool. That's the map chamber. Perhaps Professor Rockham was right to have had faith in you. I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. My memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. <coughs> Thank you, Professor <coughs> Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. So is this the... Cool. I was a tad bit worried Rebellion. that um, it was going to make me do one of those fight the knights over and over again while doing reality bending. Uh, damn. <laughs> so glad this one is quick and to the point. Isadora? Isadora? Taking more than their pain. Mr. Morgan? Yo. She imperious to her own father. Son, I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father. First of all. What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. 
Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. Students? We must gather the others. Turn to your common room, all right? Isadora. Everyone feels pain. And why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer. Not my father. Not my students. So you're just gonna hive mind them? No one. Isadora. Set down your wand. You taught me to hone my power, not throw it away. She's too emotionally charged I did not teach in you everything. This. Expelliarmus! I wonder if it was just a coincidence that I ended up choosing the same one as her, or if it's coded that. She ends up the same one as you, given your choice. Ha! And that's why she's not on the records. She's alive. She's not. See, I feel like I like San Bacar will do what is necessary. below Hogwarts where you fought Isadora is that the location of the final repository it is you see we could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many so we did all that we could to keep them safe we also realized that until they could be destroyed the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind hence we became keepers Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us. To allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. Yo. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? 
I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. It's underneath the map chamber. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. I'll see you soon. Kind of regret not telling her now. But he can make up for it. Just, yeah. Um, How nice to see uh, shut up, Ignatia. I really don't like her. <laughs> like, at all. Um, just annoying. I really... Just... It stops me from wanting to fast travel everywhere. And I mean, that's probably why they did it. But... They didn't have to make her so annoying, did they? There we go. What's the bet? By the time I get there, I'll receive a few owls. Of need, here I come. And I think at least one of them will be from Poppy. Because... We still have five left to do. There's Ollivander's. I hope he can help me crawl. I'm just gonna quickly wait, see if that does anything. There we go. Huh. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Ollivander. I wondered if you might be able to help me with something. Good to see you, my young Ravenclaw friend. Allow me once again to express my family's gratitude. They were pleased to learn that the wand Richard Jackdaw disappeared with those many years ago had been located, even if it was somewhat unusable. Glad to hear it. Now, I received an owl from Eleazar, uh, Professor Fig. He was a bit cryptic. Said you need to have a special wand crafted. That you'd bring me the materials. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I have them here. Oh, my. How extraordinary. Remarkable design. I will be honest, I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is something else entirely. Keeping me on my toes, aren't you? I think I can work with what you've brought me. Let me see what I can do. I was actually hoping that Mr. Moon would have a um It is done. Dialogue about the demiguy's mask, but he doesn't. Oh I should warn you, I've never seen a one like this before. My suspicion, as Professor Fig implied in his letter, is that it serves a unique purpose. I doubt you shall find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you, sir. I 
Ashwinders. I'm afraid Arlo himself. you're on your own. I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. Oh, come, come. No need for such theatrics. In light of what Ranrock now knows, you must agree that our interests are aligned. Our interests will never be aligned. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours? The final repository belongs to wizard kind. We would be fools not to work together. What's that you've got there? Nanya. How Might bad is it? sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> that repository is my birthright! Charles Rookwood wouldn't have wanted you near it. <laughs> the arrogance. Should have known better than to try and reason with a child. I've always said children should be seen and not heard. Bring it on, big boy. I got you. Damn. Ashwind is so weak. Could literally just do this. Rebellion. I'm gonna say, guys, I can't leave until I kill you. you should never have You should have been better, bro. Oh, frame rate drop. Stronger than you all day, every day. You see who? It ain't me, boy. It ain't me. I can't believe it. Rookwood's reign is finally over. I need to send an Altanati right away. For now, though. I need to get back to the map chamber and tell Fig what happened. Where are we? Map. Um, challenges. Oh, yeah, this is the main mission. Duh. Straight to Jackdaw's tomb. Hang on. 
time for a jaunt, I'd say. Here we go. There we go. Faster. I mean, this this grab horn feels really good to ride. Like, I need to race now, my friend. Oh come on! Why can't I show these two? And you say they made it after you placed the moonstone. Yes. Do you know why or what it means? Does it have to do with the Snidgets? The breadth of one's knowledge can be as wide as the seas, and yet only run so deep. It's good to see you again, Doran. Did Poppy tell you about everything that's happened? She did, and I am glad to see that you are both safely returned. I did question the wisdom of sending you on a path at a time when that path was unknown at best. Deadly at worst. But the acumen of the centaurs is neither personal nor partial. The skies tell us what is to come, and often we do not know what we have seen until it has come to pass. You knew the poachers would try and kill Poppy and me. I did not know, my young friend. But I shall say that I was not surprised. It was in much the same manner that I expected our first meeting. I don't suppose you'd like to start from the beginning. I think Poppy and I could use that. Of course. I find it is often the best place to start, is it not? Many, many moons ago, I divined a series of events. Their meaning long evaded me until you brought news of the Snidgets and their poacher pursuers. I believe the symbol created by the Mooncalves dance marks the place the Snidgets are hidden. And serendipitously, I believe that I know the very place. Please, go on. Yeah, I have seen that symbol only once, on a rock face in the cliffs of the forest. You should make haste there. The Snidgets that have been kept there for so many years may no longer be safe. Hmm. If you're right about this place, then we should make our way there. I shall see you there. We cannot afford to lose the Snidgets once again. All these talks about Snidgets. Snidget this. Snidget that. Is this where we're going? All right, I feel like we're going here, somewhere. What are you up to now? It's like a place right out of a story. Well, we don't have the mission yet, so we'll wait till day and see if we get an hour. There it is. Something indispensable. I'd be set for that. Damn it, Natty. Oh no. Here's Poppy. Our post. I just want to read it out quickly. Where is it? Uh Poppy is just there. That one. Did I just have to wait for her to get there? I'm sure. But let's go do this. <laughs> now the only reason why I know this is here um, is because when I came here to catch measles one time, um, I ended up catching like three or four shinies just from this one area. Um, and then as I was adventuring around, well, you could imagine what had happened. Uh, I don't really need another shiny nasal. I kind of bred one from a shiny and a non-shiny. So, just talk to Poppy. I got here as soon as I could. Did you see the symbol above the entrance? It's the one the Mooncalves made at the Henge. Of course, Doran implied as much, but to see it up there. Could this actually be where the Snidgets are hidden? Let's find out. 
Doran's waiting for us just up ahead. Did he clear out the spiders? Are. I bet he didn't. Can you believe it? Actual snidgets. I'm glad we seem to be a step ahead of the poachers. It is a little strange we haven't heard anything from them. If we're lucky, they're still poring over Gran's research. There was a fair amount. We, on the other hand, had Doran to guide us. Even if the poachers do somehow stumble upon this place, we shall be long gone. Greetings. What I hope we haven't kept you waiting long, Doran. Not at all. Then again, it is not I who awaits your arrival. Do you have the Moonstone with you? Of course I do. do. Good. It's as, as important to what happens next as both of you are. So, what does happen next? What are these pillars here? A safeguard, I suspect. There is only one way to find out. And as for how to go about that, the two of you may know better than anyone. Akio! So first, place the stone. That's exactly what I assumed it was going to be. Um, so that sun symbol and that symbol there. I wonder if the pillars move at all. Ah, uh, I see, I see, I see, I see. I don't know. Back this way, back this way. So we're using the moonstone, um, the pillar as a sundial. And then with this one, we want to use it back to the angle that it's pointing there. And that should open that door. Ah, wait. Oh, what am I pointing it at then? Oh right, I was meant to go the other way. Okay, so we'll grab this one. Keep pulling. And stop. Perhaps I suspect we all know what lies beyond that passage. And now I'm afraid I must leave you. At least for a time. You're not coming in with us. Revelio. If the snidgets are here, the herd will prove the truth to themselves. Elec especially. Go on without me. I will rejoin as soon as I am able. Come on, Poppy. Look at the murals on the wall. They're all creatures. It's a this place must have been built to protect them. They had nothing to fear. What makes you say that? The poacher camps always felt oppressive. It's hard to explain, but the feeling was palpable. At least to me. So many books. The sense I get. You haven't seen my grand study. Revelio. Sorry for cutting you off there, Poppy. Sound a dribble. I wonder. Was it Poppy's grandmother who helped? Defender. Confringo. Bombarder. Revelio. Nah. I know that, but how do I get upstairs, bro? Accio! Fungardium Leviosa! The Pulsar! Leviosa! Jump up there. Ah, of course. 
course I'd be in here. Lumos. Lumos. Yeah, it's right, double snare. You ain't gonna get me. There it is. Back it up. Lumos. Rebellion. Alright, that was that. Um, is that a bag or is that a chest? I'll wager this isn't the dead end it seems to be. But how to get through? I will wager that you're right. That one. Where's the other one? Akio, Guardian Leviosa. What's up there? Akio. <laughs> Such a good shot. Incendio. Glacius. Rebellion. How clever. Am I missing something there? Look at this place. No. So it's saying down. No. All right. It may be further into the cave, and it's just picking up on the mini map quite early, because I've still got the um. Oh really? What was that? Not Dora, that's for something. Can freak up! What have you done? I don't even have a level. Anybody else want it? Come get it. Oh. Rebellion. 
Relatively, yeah. To return before it was too late. We're fine, but if you hadn't got here when you did, <laughs> I led them here, Doran. You fought with us against your kind. Did I am did. glad to have witnessed this. I now believe all that Doran told me. They are the ones I saw, Elik. Finish your work here, brother. All the events you divined have not yet come to pass. Unlock the doors to the Snidget Sanctuary. Yo, that's cool. is to break the charm. You want us to? Yeah, you do it, Poppy. I only ever wanted to see them safe, which they are. You should do it. Fine. They're gonna hatch, aren't they? Like straight up, straight away. Oh, what the hell is that? Merlin, they're lovely. But what happens now? They can't care for themselves, and surely once word gets out of their reappearance. <sighs> no harm will come to them. The centaurs will see to that. You have my word. Thank you, Doran, for helping us to find them and to fight for them. It is you who deserves the merit, child. You did what the poachers would never have. Remember that. You both fought bravely today. Allow us to carry the mantle from here. If it's all right, Doran, I think I'd like to stay behind and spend a little more time with the Snidgets. Revelio. Hmm. There's an after storyline mission, isn't there? No, oh, I can't see the map. And who can I talk to to get out of here? Or do I gotta walk? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm still confused. As to this one. Um. Thing as well. Give me a second. All right. I don't understand how this is going to work, but we'll progress through and see what Natty has to say now. And then we'll try and wrap it all up nice and neatly. One last episode. Um, nicely capping off this Hogwarts adventure. Couldn't even check where Natty was.
which kind of sucked. Oh, she's a Hogwarts. No, she's not. Why are you all the way down there? Sure, okay, whatever. Let's go talk to Natty. <laughs> Are you ready to finish Harlow? Uh, he's dead. I'm ready to finish Harlow once and for all. What is your plan? I received an owl from Mrs. Bickle. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. Suggested we could gather evidence from a friend near Manor Cape. Hmm. She warned us to stay out of it. Was rather adamant about it. Precisely. Harlow knows that we saved Archie. And that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from nope. Mrs. Bickle, did it? I do not believe it did. Harlow intends to ambush us. But now we have the upper hand. We can prepare. We are stronger than Harlow, and he knows it. That's why he's resorting to this sort of trickery. I thought I killed him. Let's go. Agreed. Let's finish this. Brilliant. Harlow's reign ends today. Perhaps we ought to inform Officer Singer of our plans. I already sent her an owl to let her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Are you concerned she might tell <laughs> your mother? Indeed she will, but so be it. I am tired of hiding it from her. My mother needs to understand that I will not be safe from the Ashwinders until everyone is. I shall pursue them until they are finished, and I think she knows that. As do you. That I do. I sense he is close. Where is he? I do not know. The pulse should look around. Knock knock. Confringo! Animal children, defend us! Second one! Incendio! Confringo! We will place it! Imperial! First up! First easy jumps! You knew it! What happened to that other rock? Just got sent off into space. Watch my back. Natty, watch yours, bro. Come on. Oh, here we go. Theophilus Harlow. Little Nat Sionai, in it, and her excruciatingly loyal companion. You two have done quite a bit of damage to my business interests. Oh, it was Brookwood that I killed before. <laughs> but I must gradually give you some credit. What was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic. Fortunately, I pride myself on my problem solving skills. Why is he wearing the dark, like almost the dark mark? That's cool. Come now, you can do better than that. Oh, really? Oh, new button press. Done. Crunchy out. 
It's only been crucioed, she'll be okay. Nighty. You gonna do something about it now? She got crucioed. She didn't die. She can't die. What the hell, game? Are you sure you are up for a visitor? Yes, mother. I feel fine. And it will do me good to see my friend. Very well. But do not overdo it, Natsai. I know, mother. <laughs> <coughs> Are you going to soft lock me from this? There we go. It is good to see you, my friend. Sorry, Professor Ono. I'm glad to see you're doing so well. I am doing better than it appears. I am only here because my mother insisted just to be safe. I was relieved when she told me that you were all right. Only because of you. How are you feeling? Well, I've had better days, but Nurse Blaney says that I am on the mend. I'm sorry, Natty. It's my fault you got hurt. What? No. Do not blame yourself for this. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... You did what came naturally. I suppose it was instinct. Yes. I could not simply stand there and let you get hurt. Then I shouldn't feel guilty. Of course not. There was nothing that you... Oh. Oh my. I cannot believe that it took me this long to see it. He made a choice. Based mm -hmm. on instinct, my father, you, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what I know of him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. That's very kind of you to say. Yay, personal growth and I healing. Hope that you are right. <laughs> this has all been a bit much, hasn't it? Taking down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot. But we have done it. Rookwood is dead, Harlow is on his way to Azkaban, and the rest of them are on the run. A few of the dregs will still be about, fighting for their lost cause. But Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. Everything is safer now because of us, because of you. Thank you, but we make a formidable team. You, my fellow traveler, have enriched my time at Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. Thank you. I believe your friendship to be one of the most important in my life. Thank you Thank for coming you. to visit me. It is always good to see you. I think that's all three of them done now. Uh, trophies. <laughs> Nature of the... Oh, I just gotta braid it. Um, gotta spend one more, get the achievement. What are these hidden ones? Toast of the town, right. Right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Have we not completed Poppy's relationship line or Sebastian's? Really? I thought we had. How many challenges have we got left? How many? 97%, eh? We have two missions and a main story quest. Talk to Poppy. You can't imagine how inconvenient was before I invented blue powder. Just the person I was hoping to see. I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the Snidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the centaurs. And I wanted to thank you when the poachers ambushed us, right? It was nice not to face them alone. Happy to of help. course. 
It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so. I am glad you came to Hogwarts. It's already been my best year. Hmm. I wouldn't want a repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the Three Broomsticks. Had no idea how lovely it was there. Had you never been to the Three Broomsticks? I used to spend most of my time with Highwing. And, well, I don't know how Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. <laughs> Highwing's the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Highwing is nice company, but perhaps it's time to add a few more friends to your circle. I am starting to see the appeal of a human friend. <laughs> it was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. And share Highwing. Does your Gran know that we found the Snidgets? I couldn't hold it in any longer. I told her everything. She was livid that I'd been anywhere near the poachers. But she confessed that she was rather envious about the Snidgets. <laughs> it has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. Don't know that I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. And with centaurs as allies, I might actually go looking for trouble. <laughs> of course you would. You and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Perhaps Hywin can join us? Perhaps.